it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate We lie, but we know We can't wait to win. How can we keep living by faith in our everyday life? Hello guys, this is Shuntel and today share, it's just a reminder to each and every one of us that we can keep living on our faith in our day to day life as our inspiration because we all need inspiration to motivate us to keep living even we are struggling. Yes, faith is very important. And how can we really keep living on faith when we are struggling of something? This is just a share. Of course, I am inspired of what I am reading in the scripture. Yes, we all must have faith. We all must have to believe into something to believe into something we have to know that God is our source that God is our creator that he is with us and he is not against us it is very important that we know who is our source if we really want to keep living in faith in our day to day life we have to understand that we come from our source. And who is our source? God is our source. And He is with us. And He is leading us every day. I know it's not easy to believe right away. But in my situation, I need to have that faith every day for me to be motivated, for me to keep on living even I am struggling, for me to keep on going with the struggles in this life journey. Living alone as a single parent has never been easy for me. But I keep on believing, I keep that faith within me, knowing that God is taking care of me, knowing that He is my source, knowing that I am not alone. He is with me, He is for me, and He is guiding me and taking care of me and my children every day. That is very important. If we really want to live our best life, we have to understand that faith is important in our day-to-day -day life. We must have that faith. We must integrate faith in our everyday life. We have to be aware of that and live a life according to that faith you are believing for. Why I am talking about this? Because here in the foreign country, especially here in Norway, Many people took suicide because they cannot take it anymore. And one of that is my husband and my stepson just lately take suicide because of the depression, because of the anxiety, because it seems so hard for them to live in a day-to-day -day life. Of course, it is hard for them to live in a everyday life when they are struggling with depression because we don't we don't believe in God. To have that something we believe on is very important. That can guide you and lead you every day. That can inspire you. That can motivate you. Just knowing that God is love. God is love. And knowing and understanding that He loves each and every one of us. And we survive this life because He is with us. He is taking care of all of us. Therefore, it is very important to integrate faith in our day-to-day -day life. I know it's not easy, but believe me, we all must need this. Based on my experience, that my husband took suicide and his son, my stepson, also took suicide. Yes, these two human beings just 
talk suicide because of the anxiety, because of the depression, because they don't understand that there is God who loves them unconditionally, that there is God who helped them in their day-to-day -day life. Therefore, we must be aware to integrate faith in our everyday life. And I am sharing this with you just to remind you that we have these tools to live our best life, even we are struggling. I want to share with you some simple ways to integrate your faith into your everyday life so it becomes a natural expression of who you are. We must listen with an open mind. Intelligent people are always ready to learn. Yes, we are capable of learning. Be slow to speak and give generously. Pray every day. Pray about the things you want and pray about the things you are grateful for. Yes, practice an attitude of gratitude and you can express your gratefulness through praying about it. Be a peacemaker. I know it's not easy, but you have to understand if you really want to live a successful life, have a peaceful heart and be a peacemaker towards anybody. Avoid negativity. It cannot be avoided. We hear negativity around us. It's not easy, but the words are there. We're hearing it in and out from one day to another. Avoid negativity and when you can hear negative words, turn that around into a positive word. Give people room to mess up. Always remember that nobody is perfect. We can be messed up every now and then, but accept the facts that everyone is not perfect and we can be messed up from one thing to another. So give, be, give people a room to mess up so they can learn from their mistakes. Keep your word. It is very important that you know how to keep your word. Don't promise anything which you cannot make it. Keep your word and do something with it. Stop promising into something that you cannot do anything. You can really do it. If you really want to do something with your life, if you want to integrate faith in your day to the life, you have to keep your word. Be honest to each other and be true to yourself. What you have said, you will done. But your promise, you will fulfill. It is very important that in our day-to-day -day life, we know how to express ourselves in a natural way. And how can we express ourselves in a natural way? Be a good listener and have an open mind. Be good to listen and be slow to speak. And whatsoever you have, share it to others. Be a generous giver. Give generously what you have right now. And pray about it. Pray about everything. Praying is about seeing gratitude to our source. And who is our source again? God is our source. So we can pray every day thanking Him. And at the same time, we have to pray to ask Him to guide us, to lead us, and to bless us every day. For me to keep on living every day with faith, it is very important for me that I have peace in my heart, I have peace in my mind, 
and no stress at all that I can handle the stress. I can be grateful that I am alive today. I can be grateful for all the blessing I have. Being grateful, speaking an attitude of gratitude is a must here to do. Yes, we need that faith every day. We must keep on living by faith so we can have our best life. So we can live a peaceful life. Think always, there are so many things you can be grateful in your life. And that is very important that we can acknowledge it and speak it loud. Avoid negativity is a master. And if you really want to live your best life, ignore the negativity. And if you cannot ignore it, turn that around into a positive thing. Always remember living by faith every day we must know our source you have to understand who created you where you come from you need that in order for you to have that good feeling living by faith in your day-to-day -day life this is just a share a reminder to each and every one of us and we are all capable of doing that for ourselves in order for us to live our best life. This is Yundel. Thank you for listening. Thank you for dropping here in my channel. I am very grateful to each and every one of you. I love you all and bye-bye. Like we feel the same. We love what we have.